Hey guys, it's Nikki. Welcome back to my channel. I just wanted to do a project share with you tonight. I created a quick loaded envelope in a Halloween theme using up some of the papers that I cut down last night. Um, so I just have one of the papers that I left 12 by 12. I used on the back. The front I used one of the 4 by 6 cards and uh, they might have both been the 4 by 6 cards cut down into the shape of the bag. I used a rosette that I had made up already. I used one of my sewn circles, one of my little sewn embellishments down here. I used some of my chipboard stickers. I added this little pumpkin paper clip that I received in a swap last week. I added one of the glittered spider webs on the back. I have that glued on. I made a little bag topper using again some of the embellishments that I put together last night a little glittered bat here that I received in a swap and then I used uh, some of the crepe paper rosettes that I made I put in a, a little cellophane bag so that's in the front pocket in the back pocket I have some of these glittered pumpkins that I picked up at Target earlier in the season so I'm gonna send those along I might put these in a, a baggy but they just kind of fit in the back and kind of keep things stable so they're fine as they are if I decide not to do that. I'm using this witch topper bag that I received in a swap and I'm adding one of the embellishments that I created last night just a, a kind of a loaded rosette and uh, it's really chunky so I put that on there. I packaged up some straws and added some glitter and I have a package of cut aparts that I included. This was from the Simple Stories collection. I just made a big topper and then used some ribbon to put across the top. And then lastly, I have some brads that I um, kept on the packaging they came on. I added just a little strip of paper that coordinated with the papers that I'm using. And then I repackaged it in a um, Oh, this was, I believe, some brads from Hobby Lobby. And then I added one of the uh, embellishment pieces that I made last night and a chipboard bat. So that is it. I'm gonna put everything back inside. And again, um, I was able to use up a lot of things in my collection by doing this. Um, having the pieces cut apart is really convenient and um, it helps me craft really quickly actually. Everything was here at my disposal, everything was you know already sewn together so I was able just to kind of go through everything that I have in here, just pick out something that coordinated and glue it on. So this is what it looks like finished. I may add a spider to the front here before sending out. I have um, Oh, some bugs and some spiders in here. I've, I received some of the little hands that are from Dollar Tree. I received those in a swap also last week. You know, so I might add something before sending it out. Something like that just to play on the spider web theme. Um, and it's nice and chunky already. So adding that isn't going to be that big of a deal for when I'm mailing it out. So that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.